Cup third round. The result, a predictable nil-nil. But there was better news from the first league game at a muddy Selhurst Park. It's Rado Savic, but trade up to Nigel Martin, who really has no problems with that. So, oh, Everton having a good spell, coming forward again. And the man who's had the two best chances for Everton so far. Forward to Beardsley, always buzzing around. Good low cross, but well anticipated by Jeff Thomas. Armstrong getting between the two defenders and Southall there acting as a sweeper. Oh, Everton at the moment putting a stranglehold on midfield. Got four players there. Palace with just three, finding it hard to provide the service for their front two. Martin Keown forward, two ride outs. Everton building up well as always to the edge of the box. Uh, Snowden tries to get in on the end of that one. Claims obstruction, ignored by referee Milford. Well, Roger Milford stopping play. <laughs> I saw the ball's always difficult for defenders with the new law. Newman away. And really is quite a tussle between Rideout and Eric Young. Free kick quickly taken as well. A chance for Matthew Jackson. And Matthew Jackson opens the scoring for Everton. Everton take the lead at the start of this second half. Matthew Jackson are the triumphant goal scorer. Ball will run for McGoldrick, and Barlow's nipped in there, looking for support, it comes from Beardsley, and not the sort of finish you'd expect from a 49 cap player, and that could have sewn it up for Everton. Southall calls, collects, and finds Peter Beardsley, and Barlow on side. Presses it all supports and brings the best out of Nigel Martin. Mm, Leverton, not surprisingly, not throwing too many men forward for this corner. They've got four or five players still back. Mm, Beardsley onside. And Beardsley. Number two for Everton, Beers is seventh of the season and that surely wraps it up for Everton.